Now we're back and we're going to create our B section for our song. So we've started out with our um, the smart drums and created our first initial um, segment of our song. So how we do that? First of all, we find the plus sign at the top right corner where the green ends. And if you tap that plus sign, it's going to give you some information about song sections. So it says section A, eight bars. We are going to add, so tap add, a B section that says eight bars. Then you tap anywhere off of it and it goes to the B section. Now you won't hear the A section because you're now creating the B section. So what I want you to do is instead of using this, you're gonna tap add instrument button at the top left. You're gonna go to beat sequencer. This is gonna be so fun and it looks a little bit intimidating, but maybe not. Now under beat sequencer, look at the bottom row. There's a ton of places you can tap. We're just gonna deal with the left hand side on the bottom. So you see it says modern 808. Go ahead and tap that. You've got a whole bunch of different drum kits that we're gonna use from. And if you look under acoustic, you've got about four. Electronics got a whole bunch of different ones. And percussion is just Chinese kit. So we're just gonna play, let's play. So if I take Chinese kit, it gives me something. Tap the dice, it changes it. Now tap the button next to that. You've got patterns. So start playing with it. Alright, I'm gonna stop it. Dirt road. I'm gonna press the green button in the middle to stop it. If you look at the top underneath the uh, timeline with, with the numbers, you see four different patterns. It's selected one. So what you can do is you're gonna, you can uh, record four different sections, segments, two measures each. So if I wanna play with this first segment, I can add a couple different things and see how I like it. Okay, so if I like that, then I can leave that. I can tap the next one, which changes, all right. And, oh, I just did that. But you'll see there's more instrument at the bottom. Hey, there's cowbell. Let's more cowbell. More cowbell. Let's give it cowbell all the way through. Let's see if we like that. That's kind of fun. All right. Uh, so let's go to the third one. All right. What do we want more of? Maybe more of the kick drum. I just keep tapping them on and off mess around. You can create patterns or you can just leave it as is. Okay, let's hit play. Let's see where it is at the top. Okay. And then the last one, whatever, I can do that. Or I can just roll the die. Now rolling the die makes means it rolls the die for everything. So whatever you've changed, uh, it will go to whatever it's the the um, just a random one. All right, so maybe I don't want Chinese kit. Let's go to electronic. There's some fun names here: crate digger, hacienda, trap door, pile driver. So you just tap on it and just kind of see what you got. Okay, and then if you tap that second one that's got, um, looks like a waffle, tap it and you can try these other ones. Um, back and forth is kind of fun. So look at that. So it goes across and it goes back. And across and it goes back. It's kind of fun. Um, so I can tap this and fix that and tap that and fix that. Do a, the die. Um, here's wavy. You can see it's just kind of wandering back and forth. It's just really interesting. Check that out. What is that doing? Look at that. Just craziness. Triple it, triple it, triple it, triple it, triple it. So when 
you've found what you wanted, um, then you of course record. Get your playhead at the beginning and hit record. You can change it as it's going. your B section. Now, when you're when you're preparing this, don't hit record until you've got each segment exactly the way you want it. Because tapping it during the play the recording, it just is you're not fast enough. Um, because it goes faster than you. So once you've got your A section done, you did that, and now you put your B section in, tap the plus, and you go all sections. Okay, so now we can tap off of that and you can hear all of it. So if you go to the track view, you're gonna see there's your A section and there's your B section. Okay. If you don't like it, that's the time to re-record. Now you'll notice on this particular song, I didn't have any extra instruments. Um, so you could of course always add extra instruments. And what you really want to do is um, when you're done with the B section, you're going to add the A section again. And I'm going to make another video and tell you how to do that. All right, go ahead and have some fun with your B section.